Hi, welcome back to the Protagonist Corner. I'm Jonathan. This is Final Fantasy 16. And in our last video, we were told we needed to head to Lost, Lost Wind to put our to put our boat together that's somehow composed of Stardust and a whole bunch of Techno Babble. But hopefully things will get better now that we're here in Lost Wind. Maybe we'll get an actual quest that's fun to play through. Let's find out. Um, that is, once I get my bearings, we'll find out. Pretty much have them. Um, or am I slightly lying? Nope. Well, no, there's nothing up there. God, I should have set this up this morning. But instead, instead of us playing the Star Ocean game, and we'll be cover we'll be covering a few of those, I'm sure, eventually. You know what, maybe I can find a better fast travel point? Let's try. I didn't actually look at the map to figure out where we're going. Um, no, the fast travel point thing isn't really going to help us that much. Well, actually it might a little bit, because look at this. Um, you know, we're... So it looks like we have a trek ahead of us. Oh, but at least there's some people to play with, so let's take care of them. Let's make sure they don't feel lonely. Okay, they didn't want to play that badly anyway. It's fine. I should know. I should know. It's not gonna let me jump. I've, I've played this game before. We all know it. Yeah, this is good. Across the bridge we go. Hey, wanna play? By which I mean wanna die? Cause you're going to. Thank you for playing and dying. And thanks for the treasure! Run! Get the treasure! I predict Kai wins! And then with the Weatherman, I'm actually right! Or weather people. Weather entities. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, this is fine. And look, looky here, we're going back into the lost one. But maybe it's a different entrance. Or at least I intend to, I'm pretty sure. Oh, um, we'll pick, we'll pick that up first. Eventually. There we go, got it! You never know when you need more gale, so it's fine. Oh, map please. It's arguably fine, just like right down here someplace. It's like an aqueduct thingy. It's not an actual place to get into the town. I should know that. There's a reason they marked the lost one of the quest point, even though it didn't look true. And it really didn't, for the record. Hi, treasure! Nice to see you again! And this is our quest area. Yay! It would have been much easier if they said, well, it's not exactly in town, and here's the person we need to talk to. I ran right past him. Let me catch back up. Where are you? I know you're somewhere here. There we go. Hi there! Let's chat! That is what she said. Just over there, as is the creature I told you about, I'd imagine. Oh, a creature, you say. Of course. I'll be right back. Let's deal with said creature. Yay. And let's along, along the way, let's pick up more treasure. Oh, well, no, there's a cutscene happening. We're dealing with the creature right now. Torgo found him. Oh, it's another one of you guys. You probably know too, like the other one does. Oh, not what I want. I'll deal with that, though. Oh, God. Yeah, let's not get caught in that, please. That'd be no fun. Alright, let's switch again. Like we did last summer. I probably should have dodged that. I definitely could have. We all know it. Oh, God. For the record, I hated fighting this thing the first time. Oh yeah, I did level it up off camera. Forgot to mention that. And it did a nice slice of damage. Oh yeah, I don't know what I was smoking, but it was good, trust me. I don't know why I did my triangle move there. Oh, yeah, stay out of there, please.
Stagger! Kaboom! I really enjoy that move now. Even more than I used to. Halfway home, one stagger bar. That was the luckiest dodge I ever had. Yeah, I probably should have just taken that on the chin. Sorry about that. Stagger one more time. At least some of the hit will take it. Nope. Better to be lucky than good, we all know it. Oh, bad timing. Oh, man. That was painfully bad. I can't believe I need to heal. That sucks so hard. I was hoping I'd get through this fight without needing to. For real, Leo. Oh, what did I even think I was trying there? Okay, at least with at least I did that without dying. That's the good news. I love that new move that I think I maxed out. That's amazing. That ultimate fire attack there. The things I do for you, Mid. Sid! Thank goodness you're safe. You shouldn't have any trouble now. Indeed. But don't let us keep you. We'll um See that everything is transported safely back to the hideaway. All right. I'll let Mid know you're on your way. Awesomeness. Okay, so back. Well, not yet. Apparently, we were cutscene. Yes, we have a cutscene that contributed nothing to anything. We needed to see Clive walk away before we could fast travel back, folks. We would have lost so much without that. By the way, that was sarcasm. I think we all know it. So, for the record, that was not Lost Wind. That was one of the Lost Wind suburbs. You could have just set that game instead of actually marking the town. Anyway, though, we are back with whatever magical mumbo jumbo um, Mid needs to build a ship. And by the way, I hate that her name's Mid. Like, we already have a Sid. We don't. Uh, we, okay, at least she thought Big Busty like Cindy was in 15. Because that sucked! That was painful! <laughs> oh, God. Shout out in the comments, please, if you know what I'm talking about. If you don't, just watch a just type in, um, Cindy washing car, 
Final Fantasy 15, and <laughs> you will know what I'm talking about. If you type that into YouTube, you will have something you can't unsee for a year. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, let me figure out where we're going here so this doesn't take me 30 years, or at least it might not. And for the record, I was afraid of that. I was afraid we were going all the way over to this piece of crap again. Okay, um... The hideaway is cool, but I hate walking through it. Like, I... This is making me long for, um, Persona 3 Portable. Where you can just fast travel everywhere when you're not in battle. So I know we're looking for the classroom, and then we're looking for a staircase that goes beneath it. So let's go downstairs here. Let's ignore Mr. Elevator, we don't need that. And please don't go back upstairs, or else I'll have to come with Harry Carey. Why is that? It's so funny that that's called Harry Carey. Because for those who don't know, Harry Carey used to be um, the play-by-play -play commentator for the Chicago Cubs. For the record, he is dead now, but that's not where the name comes from. It's some Japanese thing that I thought for the longest time was just called Sopoku or something. Or no. <laughs> no, Sendoku is the weird game, number game thing, but like, I, yeah, so they have nothing to do with each other, but like, it's we it's weird that something so Japanese and so grisly is called Harry Carey, <laughs> that's hilarious. By the way, you're stormling. Nope, no need to go in here. Alright, let's do what I usually do, where I see where I am in relation to where I need to be. And I'm on the other side of creation! That's great! Yeah, that's old news. Get over it.
She's kind of busy. That's why she's building a ship. It has star dust in it. Oh, I'm close. Cool. Okay, yeah, I'm close, but I need to look for stairs down someplace. That's what I learned. Cute. Still cute. I don't think I want this bridge. I do not. Um. And Mickey just want to play with the ship. Like, there's my staircase. I even see it right now. I just can't reach it because I'm a moron. But I thought we were going down into the up. Hold on. Yeah, this might be a problem. <laughs> yeah, the arrows is a problem. And most times you can trust the arrow. We don't want the bridge. We've established this. <laughs> I just hallucinated stairs. That was fun. You mean she's been less annoying? Oh, here we go. I didn't even know I was on it, but I was. Oh. How did I get... Okay. Easily fixed.
Yeah. I thought it was the right steps down. It wasn't. Maybe I do want to go off from here. Um. If only that were true, game. I mean, okay. If it is true, then what I need should be in the area. Um, God, I hate this. Just give me a mini map, please. Let's see what's up here. Who would do that? They presumably have beds. You're a moron, sir. Since that contributed so much to everything, let's do this again.
Oh, great. It's so it's so awesome that I'm here. <laughs> Said sarcastically because it's not it's not at all where I need to be right now. You've said that 50 clillion times! It's not my fault that I passed you trying to find this stupid bitch with the plans for the stupid magic ship with Stardust! God... Oh, I think I found the steps by complete accident. They're, by, they're like beside the steps up, but you can barely see them. I did find them. Great. So now I know a little more about where they are. They're, they're beside the, the staircase going up. You can't see it. You just have to stumble on it. Okay, that's great. I love that. And I hate your name. If I ever knew someone named Mid, I would never let her build anything. And please, like you can, you can tell me that her re that her full name's in the codex, but I'm not gonna care. You're welcome to leave the comment, have a full discussion about the entomology of her name, but <laughs> it's not gonna affect the fact that I hate what we call her. Okay, so not steel or whatever else you mentioned. What? Well, if I were in need of obscure knowledge, I know whose counsel I would seek. Yeah, I could think of two people. Uh, and that's definitely one of them, yes. Yeah. Well, history that. boy! I've got a Book history boy as opposed to map history girl. Now, the bad part about this is I need to find where Hippocrates is. The good part is we're one step closer to finishing your flesh chain. I hope he does! Please tell me the drunk guy outside is not any somebody's favorite character. Please tell me that's not the case. And yeah, I don't know that he's drunk, but yeah. <laughs> that's not something you do if you're sober. You know, place that has beds in it!
lovely breeze, isn't it? Sitting here, eating good bread, in good company, can life get any better than this? You know what, let me make this easier on myself. Let me fast travel back to the beginning of the hideaway. As dumb as that is, I'm admitting it's stupid, but it's going to help me make this faster. So, I'm doing it. It would be, I'm going to admit, it would be hilarious if I did that and ended up in the exact same spot. That's not what happened, but I would never stop laughing if it did. I would be laughing for the rest of this video, I swear. That's a shame. You'll live longer. You know what? While we're here, while we're here, let's change the let's change the track back. Oh, that was the original. That was the original Sidolphus Sid version. We don't want that. There we go. And we don't want to be here, or maybe we do. That, this might be a Hippocrates room. Let me check. It is, yay. Apocrates, do you have a moment? Do you drive? Always. Well, actually, it's for mid this time. Did you take a look at But it, it is for the cause, so it's, it's not not for you, Clive, come on. 
And of course we need to do this because it contributes so much. It's immersive! Handing people things is not immersive! Shielding for a mithril engine. Oh, I love watching the Technobabble blueprints. You know, it, it's great, because if I want to build one of these ships, I can do that, and it'll totally work. No, it won't! Even a Shrike would think it was stupid! I mean, it's, a, it's an interesting idea, but, like, this does nothing for me. It looks like it's made of a bunch of hot air balloons. At least that's what I'm saying. Maybe it's not what you're saying, but... And maybe it's my vision, but still... The blueprint, and having the blueprint instead of the com instead of seeing the performance, doesn't contribute much for me. You could have the blueprint beside the performance, do like a 24 David Cage split screen, split screen thing. And by the way, yes, I love David Cage. Deal with it. The tar? No. You have the pitch. Whatever. I see. Early Gregorian histories speak of a preparation known as moon dew. Moon dew. Now, the funny thing is, it's probably not literal, but in this world, it just might be. Stardust? Moon dew? Moon dew? What's next? Sun droppings? You know, or we, I guess we could call them raisins. Get it? Raisins? What was he even saying? Because he's been doing that. Hi, Jill. So you need a hand, do you? Are you going to applaud? I would die who I have to applaud. Oh, so who do I want to hang out with? Player choice! Okay, so I guess that begins a quest. Sure. Now, okay, since the game wants this to be a choice I'm making, let's RP this. Since Jill's turning to stone, progressively as we speak, maybe she shouldn't go on away missions? <laughs> Just saying. Oh, who am I chatting with? Margaret's? We could have done with some of that. Okay. Justinus. I doubt I would have survived that place with or without it. Yep, a Margaret's. I think either of us could handle. So, Clive, have you made your decision? Who will accompany you on your little excursion? Mm -mm. Nope. Yep. All right. So, what are we fetching? I have taken the liberty of preparing a list. Here. Well, the good news is Turkle's going to be with us. He's going to he's going to fetching too. <laughs> well, this is the right list. Looks like the ingredients for someone's supper. Though these items may seem mundane, they have potent effects that are rarely exploited. Effects for which they were once highly prized. So much so, in fact, that they were harvested almost to extinction, hence Moondews having fallen from favor. Now, of course, they can be obtained with ease. 
Okay, so actually not little moon boobs. Okay, that's great. Well, isn't that convenient? I was hoping to be able to make a trip over that way sometime soon. Need to speak to an old acquaintance. Interesting. All right. Stay safe. Oh. Oh, okay. I I was worried for a second. Away mission away. Is this actually the right location or are you lying again? Let's find out. Oh, it's exactly the right location. I love it. Oh. Stop doing that. Stay in range. Oh, do we do we right in front of my face? All I have to do was turn around. Why is it like people can see better than I can? Need to stock up on these. There you are, Talia. Ah, and there you are. We shouldn't have any problems finding what we need in a place like this. But, if time is of the essence, perhaps we should split up. Take a few items each. Don't! Haven't you heard rule number one? NEVER SPLIT THE PARTY! See now. Why don't you take the garlic and the pepio nuts? Meet me by the gate when you've got them. Hmm. Do I need to do I need to buy the do I need to buy potions? I almost didn't come out right, but let's check. Well, okay, you're not the shopkeep. But apparently there is one very nearby. Oh well first let's talk to you. You're relevant to what we're doing. No, don't jump, Clive! Talk to the man! Oh, you're the shopkeep. Okay, that that's great. Um, so that means um, you have what you got what I need. Okay. Um. But you also have potions. So yay. Um, let's see. You're not exactly enthusiastic there, are you? There's a whole lot of rent there. Don't like you. You know what? Let's see if you... Alright, we got it. Cool. Awesome. So, is this, so is this what this mission is? Just shopping? If so, lame. 
I could have taken Joe if that's the case, actually. Oh, so basically this is a money check. Making sure you still making sure you still have enough money to proceed, quote unquote. Awesome. <laughs> if that was this mission was about, just again, I'm gonna say again. If this was just about taking off a shopping list, lame. You don't need to save your save your the universe to do that. You could have picked any of a thousand runs. Yeah, that is actually a good question. Why does the savior of the universe have to do the shopping? Yeah, if you can answer that for me, please do. I'm not a complete idiot. I can read the shopping list. Of course, the person pl playing this game probably can't do that, but John, but Clive can. <laughs> Yes, what's up? Plus, we're not in too much of a rush, are we? No, well, it depends. If you talk about wanting to fuck, we're in a complete hurry and we're leaving. But <laughs> otherwise, no, it's, it's all good. Do whatever you want. That's a new level of deja vu. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Does that mean it's been five years since we met? It was a lot longer. It does. In a good way, of course. Thank you, Taya. For what? For everything. 
I really don't know what I'm thanking you for, but I want to, but I want to sound, but I want to sound like I have gratitude. So there you go. I'd appreciate it. Do you think I'd stick around if I thought it wasn't? Yeah, could it's in the script. That was pointless. The first time. Oh, question side questies. No, if you're going to work the map, work the map. Like. All right, actually, let's, let's check this way. It's quicker. Don't see any. Unless they're doing bad things we don't know about, then they're screaming up at us in pain. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. I didn't want to hand in quest or anything. I just wanted Clive to jump for joy. Record, not interested. You're completely awesome. You're among the top three in the hideout, definitely. Oh, great. We, I get to go and see mid again. This will be fun. That was, that was lame. Well, I better go and give me the good news then. It 
in the comments, you guys, let me know. What, what, what chores really drove you nuts? Um, you know, what, what, what chores did I hate? Um, well, I didn't hate the signature thing, like, what, oh, 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 um, I, 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 I remember, like, um, um, my, my, my family tried to get me using Dragon Dictate when I was younger for, for, for very good reason. They wanted me to be able, they wanted me to be able to dictate to a computer, so I, so I would be able to do more independently. I love that. I was just bad at it, and I hated trying to practice. Cause if you can't read, you can't develop. You can't very well develop a voice file. And as we all know, at least you know if you've watched my Steve Stars LP or SMT, I don't read well at all. So that was like hell on wheels for me. Um, you know. And what what would you what would you really love doing? Um. Like for the for the longest time, believe it or not, because my aunt or somebody read to me, I used to love school, uh, particularly social studies, my favorite favorite thing. Um, so what did, what what chore did you love? And I'm counting those chores if, chores if you want to use them. And what chore did you hate? I don't know. Maybe you guys love to cook. I don't know. Maybe you maybe cleaning felt the rain for you. I I don't know. Let me know. Comments. Anyway, where are we here? Um, we're looking for this scroll. And it's by the steps up. We all remember. Oh, but we need to leave this room. Because it isn't closed. So let's find the dough. Let's find the door. So just <laughs> put another way. Put the human way. Let's find the door. Oh, also, I might try talking to Apocrites again, Jum, just because I might be able to level up the codex some more. It's not important to do or anything, it doesn't say I can, but it doesn't hurt to ask. My knowledge is yours. I have compiled some new oh, we do get to level up. Well, we got to work towards it. No level gains yet, but I'll take what we can get. Awesome. Back down. I'm with the crack if I hear that again. Maybe it's because she's in the middle of something. <laughs> she's always down in that dungeon of hers, muttering away.
Yes, it is. Um, so, um, so that was a video. Well, at least we got to fight one of the die ball things. That was fun. But as far as the rest of this, I, I have to ask again. Why is the savior of the universe doing the shopping? I don't care if it's technically for the chef. A billion people could do that. If it's heated or it can build it, one of the 12 year olds can shop for nuts. Um, but still, um, if, you, if you enjoyed any part of this, leave a like on the video. Um, if you loved any part of it or love this channel in general, consider becoming a fellow protagonist. We'd love to have you. Either way, have a good one. Hope to see you again. See you next time. Bye.